These are members of House of Representatives Committee on Nutrition and Food Security with speakers of State Houses of Assembly. They are in Uwere, capital of Imo State, for a three-day retreat aimed at dialoguing on the critical issues of adopting legislative actions to improve food security in Nigeria. Malnutrition and food insecurity is sometimes referred to as food and nutrition insecurity, FNI, may become an existential threat in Nigeria if not checked. The National Bureau of Statistics proceeds that rising inflation rate has adversely affected the consumer price index, exerting pressure on both food and non-food basic items, including services. The consumer price index was highest in the urban areas about 31.95% than in the rural areas, which is 28.1%, and this is nationwide. Consequently, malnutrition and food insecurity affects every part of Nigeria, more so among... The retreat, I've said it, I'm going to repeat it again, it's aiming at giving the necessary capacity to members of the parliament at the national and state level to enable them to take action that will lead to better policy and laws that will lead to better food for the people of Nigeria. I think I can put it in simple terms like that. Thank you very much. Experts presented different papers on the implementation of the National Multisectoral Plan of Action for Food and Nutrition. The cheerful development that we are gathered here today to dialogue on the critical issues of adopting legislative actions in improving nutrition and food security in Nigeria. This retreat couldn't have been at a better time than now, owing to the factors that necessitated the establishment of this all important House Committee on Nutrition and Food Security, chaired by one of our outstanding legislators, Honorable Dr. T.K. John Okafo. Also, this gives us the opportunity to discuss and deliberate critical issues of nutrition and food security in our dead nation. We must not over overlook the pressing matter of nutrition financing. Um, allow me to state that particularly in the context of um, the 12 states that were selected for the accelerated nutrition results in Nigeria, the project by the ANRI, and by extension, if they can also inc include all states um, within the program because it's due to expire December 2024. I wish to state um, to appeal to um, you know the World Bank if there's other initiative that can be done in order for us to finance this and if not um, to have more workshops because we have to state the importance of financing nutrition in each state. Experts say there is a compelling need to take a holistic legislative approach towards mitigating challenges affecting food security in Nigeria.